Hello, my name is Caleb Fenton, and I'm a security researcher and malware analyst at Sentinel One. This is our first episode of Ask S1, where we take questions from social media every week and answer them for you. This week's question is about what machine learning algorithm we use, and specifically, do we use neural networks? Well, to answer the question, uh, we use multiple machine learning algorithms. So um, we use neural networks for some things. We use um, what are called random forests and support vector machines and gradient descent and ADA boosted uh, decision trees. We use a lot of different types of algorithms and uh, specifically for detecting malware, we'll train multiple models using multiple algorithms on the same data set. So the same um, malware and you know, non-malicious files. And then we will train what's called a meta estimator, which takes the output of those models as features uh, that way you can sort of blend together the strengths and try to um, eliminate the weaknesses of all the different models. So you get the, the best of all possible worlds. But let me tell you why I think that's a bad question. The actual algorithm you use doesn't matter. Uh, in fact, most of the time you want to use the simplest model possible to avoid overfitting and other weird errors. You want to use the least complicated algorithm possible. And what really matters is your input data, how varied it is, how much of it you have, and how rich uh, the feature set is that you're extracting from that data. So you could get a very uncool, unpopular algorithm. If you have great data, y y that algorithm can do work. Like it can be performant, it can be accurate. Uh, just you don't have to use uh, whatever's hot right now, like neural networks to actually get work done. Thanks for joining us for this week's episode of Ask S1. And we look forward to answering your questions next week.